In a remote village nestled among the lush landscapes of the Philippines, a quaint community lived in harmony. Their days were filled with laughter, shared stories, and a sense of unity that bound them together. But beneath the surface of this idyllic life lurked an ancient darkness waiting to be unleashed. Maria, a curious and adventurous young woman, had always felt a connection to the mystical folklore of her homeland. She had grown up listening to her grandmother's tales of Aswang, shape-shifting creatures that thrived on human flesh and blood. Despite the warnings and fearful glances she received from others, Maria's fascination with these stories only grew stronger. One day, while exploring the dense forest that bordered the village, Maria stumbled upon a hidden cave. Guided by an inexplicable force, she entered the cavern and discovered a collection of old artifacts, each exuding an eerie energy. At the heart of the chamber, she found a peculiar amulet, adorned with intricate carvings depicting a creature that resembled an Aswang. Unaware of the consequences, Maria picked up the amulet and felt a surge of power coursing through her veins. Little did she know, her actions had awakened a slumbering malevolence that had been sealed away for centuries. As days turned into weeks, a sinister change began to manifest within the village. Crops withered, livestock fell ill, and an air of unease settled upon the once vibrant community. Whispers of a cursed presence spread like wildfire, and fearful glances were exchanged even in the darkest corners of the village. Maria, however, remained oblivious to the havoc she had unwittingly unleashed. She became consumed by the newfound power the amulet had bestowed upon her. Her once bright eyes now held a haunting glint as she spent her nights alone in the forest, practicing dark incantations she had discovered within the hidden cave. As the village suffered, a group of elders sought to uncover the cause of their misfortune. Their research led them to the legends of the amulet and its connection to the Aswang. Desperate to save their home, they devised a plan to confront Maria and reclaim the amulet, hoping to reverse the curse that had befallen them. One fateful evening, the elders confronted Maria at the entrance to the cave. But her transformation was complete. Her body contorted, her eyes glowed a sinister red, and her voice echoed with a chilling resonance. The amulet had fused with her, making her a vessel for the malevolent energy it contained. The elders' attempts to reason with her were met with an otherworldly force that sent them reeling. The village plunged deeper into darkness. Families fled and those who remained were tormented by horrifying visions and unrelenting nightmares. The once thriving community now stood on the brink of annihilation. Maria's craving for power and control grew insatiable and the amulet demanded sacrifices to sustain its influence. She roamed the village streets under the cover of night, her transformation complete as she hunted the villagers, transforming them into lifeless husks. Amidst the chaos, a brave young man named Mateo emerged as the villagers' last hope. Armed with knowledge from the elders and an unyielding determination, he ventured into the forest to confront Maria and break the curse that bound her. Mateo found her within the cave, the amulet's dark energy pulsating around her like a malevolent aura. He pleaded with Maria, recounting their shared memories, hoping to reach the spark of humanity still buried within her. As tears streamed down her face, Maria's struggle against the amulet's grip became evident. In a moment of clarity, she begged Matteo to end her suffering and destroy the amulet, regardless of the cost. With a heavy heart, Matteo drew upon all his strength and shattered the amulet. The release of its energy was cataclysmic, and the cave began to collapse around them. Matteo carried Maria's weakened form out of the collapsing cavern just in time, but the destruction was irreversible. The cursed amulet's dark energy swept across the land, consuming the village and erasing it from existence. The tragic sacrifice of Maria and Matteo broke the curse, but at an immeasurable cost. 
the once thriving village and its inhabitants were forever lost, their memory preserved only in the haunting echoes of a dark legend. To this day, the remnants of the village remain hidden within the dense foliage, a solemn reminder of the tragedy that unfolded there. And if you ever find yourself near those forbidden woods, listen carefully. You might hear the whispering winds carrying the tales of Maria, Matteo, and the amulet's unrelenting thirst for power and sorrow. <laughs>